Hey guys, welcome back. In this video, I'm giving you a complete tutorial on how to use Evernote. Whether you're looking to take notes, organize projects, or manage tasks, this step-by-step -step guide will walk you through everything you need to know. So let's get started. First, go to evernote.com and you'll land on the homepage. Evernote is an amazing platform for staying organized. Whether you're working on personal projects, school assignments, or business tasks. If you're someone who takes a lot of notes, needs to track important information, or wants a digital workspace that syncs across devices, Evernote is the perfect tool for you. The best part is that you can start using it for free. To get started, click on Get Evernote Free. This will take you to the pricing plans. Evernote offers different plans, including a free version, which allows note taking on up to two devices with a 60 megabyte monthly upload limit. If you need more features, there are personal and professional plans available. There are also teams and enterprise plans available for you to choose from. Choose the plan that works for you, then click on Get Started. Now you'll be asked to create an account. Enter your email address, set up a password, then click on Continue. You can also sign up using your Google account or your Apple account, which makes the process even easier. Once you've completed the sign up, you'll be taken to your Evernote dashboard. Now let's take a deep dive into the Evernote interface so you can fully understand how everything is structured. When you first open Evernote, you'll see a clean and well-organized dashboard. The interface is designed to make navigation easy, whether you're taking notes, setting reminders, or organizing your work. On the left side of the screen, you have the main menu, which acts as the control panel for all your notes and tasks. This includes home, where you get an overview of your workspace. Notes, which stores all the notes you've created, allowing you to browse, edit, and search for any note. Tasks, a dedicated section for task management where you can create, track, and manage tasks independently or within notes. Notebooks, which lets you group related notes into notebooks, making it easier to organize projects, studies, or personal work. Tags, which allow you to categorize your notes further, making searching and filtering more efficient. Shared with me, where you'll find notes and documents that others have shared with you for collaboration. And finally, trash, where deleted notes are stored before they are permanently removed. At the top of the main menu, you'll find a quick add button, which is a shortcut for creating a new note, task, attachment, or even a sketch. This feature is useful when you need to quickly capture an idea without navigating through different sections. Now let's explore the Home tab in detail. This tab provides an overview of your workspace. Here you'll see previews of your most recent notes, any images or documents you've uploaded, and a task summary if you use Evernote for to-do lists. One of the best features of the Home tab is that it's fully customizable. You can rearrange widgets, add or remove sections, and tailor the layout based on what's most important to you. For example, if you frequently use tasks, you can move the task widget to the top for quick access. Now let's create your first note. Click on Note to open the Note Editor. The Note Editor is where you'll write and structure your notes. The interface is designed to be clean and distraction-free, similar to Google Docs or Microsoft Word. At the very top, you'll find a title bar where you can name your note for example, if you're taking lecture notes, you might name it History Lecture 1. Below the title, you have the main content area where I can start typing your notes. Evernote saves your work automatically, so you don't have to worry about losing anything. Evernote allows you to enhance your notes with different elements. Click on Insert to bring up a menu with options such as Tasks, Links, Calendar Events, Tables, Images, and Checkboxes. If you're working on a to-do list, then click on To-Do List and start adding items like Revise Notes or Submit Assignment. Each item will have a checkbox next to it, allowing you to check them off as you complete them. This is perfect for keeping track of assignments, shopping lists, or daily tasks. To make your notes more structured, you can insert dividers between sections. Click on Insert, then click on Divider, and Evernote will add a horizontal line to visually separate different sections of your note. This is useful when taking detailed notes with multiple topics. If you need to organize data in a table, then click on Insert. 
then click on Table, and select the number of rows and columns you need. Tables are particularly useful for schedules, comparison charts, or listing important information side by side. You can edit tables later by adding or removing rows and columns, and you can format them to fit your needs. Evernote also provides several text formatting options to improve readability. At the top of the note editor, you'll find a toolbar with options to change text style, adjust alignment, add bullet points or numbered lists, highlight text, and change the font size and color. To highlight important text, select it, then click on the highlighter icon and choose a color. This is useful for emphasizing key points in your notes. If you want to change the font color, select the text. Then click on the font color button and pick a color that helps you organize your content visually. Adding images to your notes is also easy. Click on Insert, then click on Image, and choose a file from your device. Once the image is inserted, you can resize it by dragging the corners, or adjust its alignment within the note to fit the layout better. Evernote also includes calendar integration, making it a powerful productivity tool. If you want to connect your Google Calendar, then click on Insert, then click on Calendar, and follow the instructions to link your account. This allows you to attach events directly to notes, making it easier to track meetings, deadlines, or project milestones. Now, let's talk about collaboration and sharing. If you want to share a note with someone, then click on Share at the top. Enter their email address or generate a shareable link. This makes Evernote a great tool for team projects, study groups, or workplace collaboration. You can control whether the person can view or edit the note before sending the invitation. This detailed overview covers all the essential tools and features of Evernote's interface, helping you make the most out of the platform. Whether you're using it for note-taking, task management, or project organization, Evernote offers everything you need in one place. One of Evernote's best features is its task management system. Click on the quick add button, select task, and enter the task name. You can set due dates, add reminders, and even assign tasks to team members. This makes Evernote more than just a note-taking app. It's also a productivity tool. Now let's talk about organization. Instead of having all your notes scattered in one place, you can group them into notebooks. Notebooks act like folders where you can store related notes. For example, you can create a work notebook for job-related notes and a study notebook for class notes. To create a new notebook, click on Notebooks, then click on New Notebook, and give it a name. Inside a notebook, you can add multiple notes and tasks. This makes it easy to stay organized and find information quickly. Evernote also offers tagging. You can add tags to your notes to categorize them further. For example, if you're working on multiple projects, you can use tags like marketing, finance, or personal to filter notes by category. If you need to find something quickly, use the search bar at the top. Evernote's search function is powerful. It can even recognize text inside images and scanned documents. Just type in a keyword and Evernote will find the relevant notes instantly. If you ever need to recover a deleted note, go to the trash section. All deleted notes are stored here until you permanently remove them. Evernote is available on multiple platforms, including Windows, Mac, iOS, and Android. Your notes automatically sync across all your devices, so you can access them anytime, anywhere. This is how you use Evernote as a complete beginner. It's a fantastic tool for staying organized, whether you're using it for work, school, or personal projects. If you found this video helpful, don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe. Thanks for watching.